she screams, and yet none have ever reached out to show they care. Her blood streaming, another enslaved spirit is truly now set free. This recurring nightmare is a madness that can no longer be ignored. She tried to close her eyes, but she was not preserved by the self-imposed lies. Begging for mercy, the woman child drops to her bruised and bloody knees. A neurotic father full of shame, he uses reality's acid to cleanse his family's name. Burning away what's left of her innocence, her scars are to be worn like a flag. Prayers for death fall upon her each night, but alive she still is at the day's first light. Taken to the hole in the ground, she knows that no one will care for her sounds. Not resisting her family's desires for their honor to finally be restored. A young woman embraces this last rush of suffering, anticipating freedom. The gathered crowd then begins stoning away the half-buried example of sin. Spoke her mind defending her sisters, willing to bring hope to so many. Awakening the minds of all who could hear, and doing so with never a fear. Screaming for those whose voices will never get their chance to be heard. Trapped in a steel shell with nowhere to run, her spirit set free by the bullet of the God. Why do we turn our backs to such reality? Has humanity decided to ignore insanity? End this madness before it consumes us all. Listen to their screams and answer their calls. Humanity must hear our sisters' screams.